Hello witches, it's Kristen Stregabella. I have my altar uh, going in the background. I have some interesting things going on over here. I love these um, type of candle holders that have um, the little bowl around them um, where you can put your herbs or oils or whatever in directly into the bowls. Um, perfect for setting up um, spell work. I have that one going as well. So I have three of them going on right now. Um, three different needs that I have. Um, I just thought I'd make a quick video because I know I told you guys I was back and I was going to be making videos again. So um, I've been feeling still somewhat unproductive. But, um, you know, I started yesterday um, making videos and I'm starting again to focus on doing um, at least something on my altar every day, um, even if it's something simple. Um, I bought um, a huge bag of um, tea light candles because, um, you know, even if you don't have a lot of time to do something, you can always um, do a tea light candle spell, which um, even just for motivation or um, to clear your mind, clear your thoughts, remove obstacles and things like that, uh, tea lights burn very quickly. Um, I had kind of a funny mishap the other day because I, I bought these um, scented ones years ago and apparently because the candles were so old, um, even though it was a tea light, it was a colored tea light with scent. Um, I believe it was a green apple scented one. And um, I also had like a large, um, one of those votive candles. And I figured the tea light would go very quickly and the other one would take a little bit longer. But the votive <laughs> burned down and the tea light actually took hours and hours before it, um, it burnt all the way down. So the tea light spell actually took a heck of a lot longer than the larger candle. So you never know with magic. Um, sometimes I've done things um, where, you know, I expect it to go on and on and on and the flame goes out and it's done. Um, some people believe that when it blows out or if it goes out on its own, um, that it means it didn't work. But um, I usually go with my instinct on that, and um, from what I found most of the time, um, that usually means that it worked. Um, especially more recently, I did a huge candle, and um, that one I know for sure worked because the person told me that it did, and it was a really something I, I didn't even um, feel confident enough trying to do but I did it and it worked. So um, if you don't test your hand at um, trying things that are more complicated or that you think you may not be able to do, uh, I challenge you to do so because you never know. You never know until you try um, just how powerful you are. Okay guys, blessed be. Bye.